This is Derek Prince with a word for you from the Word. Teach me your way, O Lord, and I will walk in your truth. Give me an undivided heart that I may fear your name. I will praise you, O Lord my God, with all my heart. The psalmist there focuses on one thing that is necessary if we are to walk God's way successfully. First of all, he cries out, Teach me your way, O Lord, and I will walk in your truth. We cannot walk in God's way unless God in his mercy teaches us that way. And then he says, Give me an undivided heart. And a little later he says, I will praise you, O Lord my God, with all my heart. Notice the emphasis on the heart, an undivided heart, with all my heart. That's so important that we don't have a divided heart, that our heart is totally yielded to God, that it's focused on God. We have no second loyalties. We have no options. All our springs are in God. All our expectations are from God. I've discovered in the Christian life, the further you go in God, the fewer the options. The way becomes narrow and narrow. And ultimately, those who come to the end of the course are those who find their total satisfaction in God. It's not God plus something. It's God alone. And that's an undivided heart. When we don't look anywhere but in God for our life, our satisfaction, our peace, 